Let's take you back to that Nevada governor's race, which now we can confidently project. NBC News is projecting the Democrat Steve Sisolak will not win another term, and it will go to the Republican opponent, Joe Lombardo, who is the sheriff of Clark County. This is a Republican pickup in governor's races. So we began the night with a Democratic pickup in Oregon, and now we've got a Republican pickup in Nevada. This is a race that we just got the concession statement from Governor Sisolak for. He said in that statement that he is excited for incumbent Democratic Senator Catherine Cortez Masto to win. He writes, quote, we need her strong voice on behalf of our state in Washington. But I want to underscore, we're still waiting for ballots to come in in Nevada. We haven't called the Senate race yet. We still find that too close to call between her and Republican Adam Laxalt, just a hair's breadth between them. And as Gary Grumbach told us earlier tonight, we're expecting another statement from Clark County, County Nevada, that's the Las Vegas area, tomorrow. And then after that statement, we will get another tranche of votes. So we're still working on calling that. We haven't called the Secretary of State's race in Nevada yet, too early to call. We did call the Lieutenant Governor's race in Nevada, and we are projecting that Republican Stavros Anthony will win that race. So now NBC News is projecting that Republicans will pick up the governor's race in the state of Nevada. Steve Sisolak is conceding in that, and the sheriff of Clark County, Joe Lombardo, we're projecting, will be the next governor of Nevada. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.